Hook shot goes, a runner in the lane by Patrick McCaffrey. And just appreciate the day by day. And the moment they have in front of them is special. You're, you're a top five team in the country. Enjoy it, enjoy the journey, and then make sure that every single day you get a chance to practice. You got to be a lead on defense, too. Yeah, that's exactly right. You play against so many of these tremendous players and future pros, you have to be able to guard. Five or six minutes together here and play some defense and keep Garza out of the paint. Alley oop to Wieskamp. He lays it in. He tried to break it by going back door and just to pass a little. Burns couldn't reel it in before rumbling out of bounds. Transition look for Keegan Murray on the feed from Bohannon plus one. You slow up and just like Canyon used to do it. Great kiss off the glass. You get around the defensive player. Takes on three players. Okay. Still some pressure from Western Illinois. Down by 19 points. Down low, Nunji. And the wraparound good. Connor McCaffrey. Look at this. Finesse to Jack Nunji. You have to learn against Big Ten defenses how to probe the defense, when to attack, when to bounce up, bounce it back out. And he's doing that. Ooh, great pass from McCaffrey to Nunji. I think we had beaten Kansas and taught us how to all do the hokey pokey to celebrate our big wins. So <laughs> it was, uh, I was on campus with, with some real legends. Jack Nunji filling it up again. 18 points. Whale of a return. 18 points, including this rim rocker. Good dive and bucket by Burrell, but Bohannon and his experience in a Hawkeyes uniform cannot be understated. Good job by Carolina switching, switching high out on shooters. McCaffrey the lob, beautiful on the touch to Nunji. Good teams fix the problem within the game. Can Iowa fix that lack of running problem over the next 12 minutes and 45 seconds? Yeah, that, yeah I'll see. that's interesting. Don't wait till March to do it. Do it right now. Guards that got position and seal. When you say that about Nunji, uh, just getting in the weight room, you're talking about or what? Well, yeah, eating, getting stronger, just, just all, getting, getting tougher, all those things. There you go, big boy. Like that guy. Guards running in traffic. They have struggled. We talked about defensive rebounding, how big it's going to be for them, not just to get the ball out of Iowa's hands. Look oh, out. What a feed from Frederick to Nunji. C.J. Frederick, they love to run him on the baseline, and here you see him in motion. Just going to curl this. The help defense comes from Solomon Young, but nobody helping the helper. It's just a breakdown in your coverage. Jalen Coleman lands. Slam dunk, Wieskamp. Well, so you got Luca Garza, ladies and gentlemen, playing point guard. Kicks it up to Connor on the wing. Nice little no look. And all the way from Muscatine, Iowa. The high school legend, Joe Wieskamp, throwing it down. I'll just play center, he said. I'll throw it down. And... I was offense clicking on all cylinders. There's another cut, and Wieskamp delivers again. He's coached a solid game here this afternoon against a team that's just got a lot better athletes. Go. That'll go. Here at Carver Hawkeye and the Hawkeyes. Still running, still gunning. 87-44. Everybody on this Hawkeyes roster, they demand it of each other. Lob it, finish it, McCaffrey, well, uh, Joe Tucson, okay, it didn't work the first time, but it worked the second time, flex a little bit, Patrick McCaffrey, just made the highlights, looked like it was going to be a six point game, instead now a ten point lead in Iowa with the ball, nice bounce, nice cut, good finish, and Wieskamp going to the line, by Joe Wieskamp and Brandon Newman is kind of learning some lessons here on the road going against a Wiley veteran just curling it to the rim getting contact keeping his head to the basket and Joe Wieskamp Wieskamp over Enid left it short Garza though does get the rebound and the lead they're not consistent enough to be a great team they can make that happen but just didn't get it done McCaffrey to Keegan Murray, the two-hand stuff, and he'll go to the line for a chance at one more. 
Yeah, it's very hard to keep Keegan Murray off the court when he makes plays like that. Puts Northwestern on a poster. Great pass by McCaffrey. Frederick, baseline jumper is good, and halftime arrives in Iowa City. Being the standard for Michigan State, and C.J. Frederick, there's the step back, the unguardable shot. Garza, triple team, no five second there. And here is a drive from Frederick for two to make it a three-point lead. Luca Garza against Reber. Garza off the pirouette. That is absolutely brilliant for the tie. And the lead possibly after we come back. That is just so good. It's so good, Dan. What? Garza. Oh. That's so good. It's fun to be involved. Back screen. Bohannon. Here we go. Bohannon on Young. Had him on his hip. Bohannon scores. Oh, he does it all the time. Oh, right. Look at this. This is a 12-year senior, man. Mm. I love Jordan Bohannon. Here is Garza. From the mid-range, and his jumper has gotten smoother and smoother in his career. Iowa will get one chance thanks to that with four seconds. There is time for Murray to drive. He does and scores! No, this was explosive on both ends of the floor, and, and look at Maryland. Nobody's stopping the basketball. Well, he's playing with a sense of urgency. And when you sit on the bench and you haven't been playing and you're ready to go, that's going to earn you some minutes. Adversity as a team and you have to take out one of your starters and you find success that bodes well for the rest of the season hey, Garza bullies Liam Robbins Garza. This guy's got a motor Look at it, catches right there point-blank range up fake You don't foul him no rush here a pretty good set this time defensively See if Frederick can get a shot off. He can. A loose go. play going to the goal. Northwestern final possession here with Bowie. Oh, stepping through and gliding in for the jam. The length of Keegan Murray. Well set up by his defense. I read that play. Great preparation coming out of the timeout. Mm. Is the other Hawkeye that can make tough shots, and here you see him running through a pass. Wees Camp, a thousand point scorer now in his Iowa career. Four for four from deep as Henry's got eight. Garza running right to the block and got a terrific feed from the corner. He'll go to the line for one more. Eulis. The entry from Nunji to Garza. Spins baseline jumper. Good and the foul. Luca Garza gives Iowa their first lead of the night, and he'll go to the line. Whenever there's one-on-one -on -one coverage, I don't care who's guarding him, you feel like two points is going to ensue. You know, the double team with Hall came a little too late, and, and that's what Garza's peeking for. He's looking over the middle. He sees Hall's coming, so he gets into his jump hook quickly. Hall, in the midst of a 12, two smart run, turns it over. Toussaint to push it up the floor. Oh, what a feed from Toussaint to McCaffrey to the rim, and he'll get one more. Perfect timing, perfect bounce pass, perfect dunk, and we're tied here at Carver Hawkeye Arena. Wow, is this pretty. And even better, Chris Holtman told us, if you need have anything that needs fixing, you need some furniture put together, your entertainment unit set up, anything that's not working, Zed Key is your guy. He can He's fix anything. Dwayne Schneider of Ohio State, the handyman. <laughs> that's right. We're under 50. That was a quality he, reference. Here's the patience of, of Luca Garza. Just continues to keep. Can't get the roll. Rebound Garza. And Garza impacted that just by protecting the lane. Keegan Murray with the flush. The assist to Bohannon. Big time play by Washington. 15 for Washington to lead the Buckeyes. At the other end, the answer for Bohannon. Right to the basket, Wieskamp has all seven. Ducori subs into the game. Here he is. Another assist from Garza. 
The last two possessions, big time efforts by C.J. Frederick. Jack Nunji, who will not return after suffering a right leg injury. Connor McCaffrey has not come back since suffering what looked like a rolled left ankle. How about that feed from Garza to Wieskamp for an easy two? Right here. Catches the ball in the post, does the double up. I you don't have to go to Harvard to figure that out. If two eggs are playing in, somebody's going to be open, Dad. Somebody's going to be open. You can make that layup. Pretty good defensive set right now. Doing a good job on Garza. The switch. Drive in McCaffrey. Pretty. Nice look inside for Wieskamp, who rises up for the slam. Entry to Garza. The turnaround jumper good and a foul. Nobody enters it to the post in this conference better. Really the best post feeder in the country. And Luca Garza's mind works like a game of Tetris. Defensively, you really see the impact of C.J. Frederick. Garza. Underneath, bucket and a foul, and Garza will go to the line for a chance at a three-point play. This sneaky, but I said it before, his mind works like a game of Tetris. Look, he's just a step ahead and by the time. His ninth rebound of the first half. Banton has his pocket pick, turnover number 11 for Nebraska Bowl. Banton in the lava, head to Wieskamp, and the finish for Wieskamp makes it a 22-point ball game. In this first half, let's go back to that last play, a Big Ten standout presented by Auto Owners Insurance. I'm not sure that's what he wanted to do, but he will definitely take it in the... Uh... I like the Davis three ball from the corner. Yeah, I just think that was in rhythm. I, I don't really think everyone's ready for that, but here's the thing for, for Wisconsin. Garza, unreliable, but unable to connect there. Murray, counter on a foul! So the foul was called on Davison. Uh, I, I didn't see any, uh, unless they're looking at that at the end. But like you said, Murray and Davison kind of came together after all that, and they, they checked on each other. Yeah, I mean, look. How many, I, I, I how can many see they got a little tangled up there. One more spot in the semifinals will be claimed by one of these teams tonight. Garza okay. inside, working bucket and a foul. Iowa by four. He just works so hard. You see him doing the work early. Nate Reavers gets off balance a little bit. And when you leave your feet, Garza does a great job of seeking out... C.J. Frederick. Nice catch. Oh. Oh. How about the hops to go get it and have a second?